What's up guys, this is Biz, and welcome back to my 100% playthrough of Monuments of Mars for Doom 2 on the Ultra Violence difficulty with Fast Monsters enabled. Technical info on the WAD as well as UV Fast Rules flashing up at the bottom of the video, you know how it goes. Let's get right into it, this is Map 6, Steel Militia. Let's do it. All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to Monuments of Mars. This is map six. Grab that real gun. Come right over here. Grab that real or real gun. And we're just gonna get a, a big old arsenal right at the start. Don't mind all the enemies that spawn behind you. Just come over here, follow the trail of rockets and pick up the rocket launcher. Now we've got a pretty good start here. Just need some armor. We're gonna grab that right over here. There's a nice fresh set of blue armor. Yum. So pick that up, jump down here, grab the rat suit. We definitely want to take out these skellies uh, from down here. They're very annoying on fast to deal with from up top. There's not a whole lot of cover as you approach them up there. So uh, down here, the rockets are pretty easy to dodge. And once they're gone, I like to loop over here and hopefully the enemies that we woke up when we grabbed the SSG should all be right over here and uh, we should get some nice infighting. Yeah, that worked out perfect. Then once the chain gunners are down, I like to start clearing stuff off here. We woke up a lot of enemies up top and uh, dealing with them from down in this pit is pretty good. There's spiders, there's revs, there's all kinds of stuff. So just clear them all off. At least until the rad suit runs out. There we go. We'll take this lift back up. We want to get to uh, one of the most difficult fights in this map. It's coming right up over here. But before we approach that... Uh, I definitely want that blue chew that's chilling up there. So we're gonna we're gonna clear off these enemies and then go for the secret, and then we'll go for the big fight. And these sniper enemies are just what a pain. All right, we got one more rev here. Pick up some goodies. Let's uh, take care of there's one spider here and then we're gonna grab the red key All right, <clears throat> and now we'll go for the secret here We're gonna make our way up to where those rack nose are just be kind of careful because once you come up these stairs an arch vial will spawn behind you although he's not mobile It'll just harass you if you try to go back down the stairs, so be wary of that. These manks make fighting that spider pretty annoying. And pull out the chain gun. I don't know if you can see, but there is a little secret switch down there that you can shoot, so... That's gonna lower the blue chew. There's that arch file I was talking about. Let's just deal with him. Come on. Okay, we'll grab the blue chew. After we make sure we got 100 health. Boom. I forgot to tag the secret. I hope that doesn't come back to bite me. Alright, let's make our way all the way over here. Hit this switch. It's going to lower a wall here. Now, this is a little bit of a tricky fight. And I'll explain why here in a second. Let me show you what's around the corner. <clears throat> we got two Manx, two Pain Elementals. And the big problem here is if you wake them all up, the Pain Elementals have a real nasty habit of coming right up this wall and like trying to fly up over these barrels. And they kind of get stuck on top of there and then just spit Lost Souls out like crazy. Very, very annoying. So here's my strategy. It's a little slow, but I like to pull them out one at a time. This first meatball actually teleports to the lava, which makes it very annoying. And then I'm gonna try to pull the two Mancubus. One teleports behind you. 
and the other one stays over here. But as long as we don't go too far around the corner, we won't wake up the other meatball, and that'll keep us from getting into a lot of trouble here with the Lost Souls. And that was just damn near perfect. Got a fresh uh, spacesuit there, so save that. Second secret's right back around here. Little cell pack. That's going to be very useful for this fight. You get locked in here. And then when you hit that switch, it's enemy time. We got two revs, two barons, and two hell knights, and this arena is cramped. Now, on fast, this can be a little tricky. Um... I don't know if I've ever really explained this before, but part of the uh, Revenant mechanic is when you're in a certain range, they will try to melee you and won't shoot rockets. So I think you're supposed to kind of like hang out between these two Revenants to keep them from shooting rockets while you deal with the uh, Hell Knights and Barons. But on fast, it's just way too dangerous. I like to take care of these guys first, and then uh, we'll pick one side to clear out. And, uh, yeah, hopefully it goes pretty good. So let me rewind just a bit, and uh, I'll show you how this fight went. There's one rev down. There's another one down. Now just try not to get hit too much. Go, Plasma, go. <laughs> uh, there we go. The fight is pretty much won at this point, barring any oh, costly mistakes. All right, don't panic. All right, nice. There are there is some health here, so the fight's not too difficult, but it can go very wrong very quick. All those enemies hit like a truck. One thing to note here, this is a little flaw in the map is um, we're up there now. I like to jump down and pick up a fresh uh, set of armor, but just be careful when you jump. If you land behind the switch, you will get stuck. And you absolutely can jump down behind the switch. So just something to note there. A little flaw in the map. Grab the armor. Top up on health if you need. There's one more rad suit over here. And that'll get us uh, <clears throat> through the lava without taking too much damage. I guess I was thinking about shooting a rocket at that revenant, but I decided not to all right time for the red key area just kind of clearing off a safe path here it's funny I feel like that fight even though it's the toughest one it's really just for the plasma rifle I'm pretty sure I'm not sure if you need to uh, actually do that fight at all you gotta be kind of careful here there are two arch vials so we're gonna lure them out one at a time here Down he goes, and the other one's no problem. We SSG him down. Nice. Pick up all the goodies. We're heading to the final couple fights for the, uh, I think it's the blue key. Yeah, there it is. I like to grab the Megasphere for the first fight. This is probably the most difficult of the two. Once you come in here, you're going to be locked in. And uh, yeah, let me see here. Let me let me pause it so I can show you what this arena is. So here's the door we came in. Now there's like one, two. I look at the shadows on the floor here. Once you pass through here, all these monster closets are gonna open up. There's revs. There's hell knights. There's pinkies. Um, pretty difficult. Wouldn't be too bad except you have these damn arch files, and the cover from them is. I mean, very, very minimal. Uh, you can really only hide right here. 
that'll provide protection from both of them. Like if you stand here, you block one, but the other one can see you. Very nasty this room is. Uh, luckily, these little monster closets, I'm not sure if they're designed this way on purpose, but they have like just enough indent here and I'm going to actually uh, abuse those, so. I like to clear off one of these monster closets. You tuck right back in the corner here. Plasma, anything that gets close, everything else should infight, and as you can see with fast, we're just tucked enough into this corner where the projectiles hit the wall. Once all these enemies are dead, we take care of the two archies here. There's one. So yeah, this is quite a nasty arena. It's not the worst though. I think the plasma um, little arena is just so cramped. I definitely died there more than I died here. This strat is pretty, pretty foolproof. Hit three switches to open the door. Let's go ahead and grab the blue. Hey, go grab the blue chew. <laughs> there we go. All right. Come right on in here. There's lots of ammo. This fight is definitely not as hard as either of the two previous big fights, but um, it can definitely go wrong, and I'll show you why. There's going to be four arch vials here. We got two right here that can flank you, so you want to go kind of quick. Luckily, we do get the double damage block map bug there. I think I took that arch out in like two rockets. And then we got two, uh, two archies camping over here. Just getting covered. Oh, man. All right, there we go. Taking one of them out is really going to um, make this area a lot easier. And then down here, we get a cyber demon and four barons, I think. Yeah, four barons. Um, these guys aren't very tough. However, we do have to jump down through that window. And uh, you can get blocked from the monster's infinite height, which makes this a little bit dangerous to camp up here and take care of that one extra arch file. But my opinion is worth it. Just kind of waiting for a good time when the cyber demon is not shooting rockets, so we don't catch a lot of splash. And then we just go, and we're good. Plasma the cyber down, and then we'll deal with that last arch file. Uh, these are pretty fun challenge arenas, you know. Just good use of enemies here by the mapper really doing a lot with you know not much only 100 enemies in this map all right there he goes nice now make sure you grab the blue key or else you won't be able to get in this door <laughs> all right and uh, yeah now we're heading back to the main part of the map And we'll come down here to the left. There's that final secret I forgot to tag. Got two paint elementals here, but they're no match for the plasma. Just lay on it. Got one final enemy guarding the exit switch. And we are out of there. That's map six, Steel Militia. Very fun map, very fun map. I realize now that I probably should have um, gone through and looked at who all the uh, the map authors were. So I'll probably do that in the final level uh, at the end of it. But yeah, this was this map was a lot of fun. Really enjoyed this one and um, just some nice clever fights. Yeah, thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed. We'll see you. We got one more map for Monuments of Mars and it's going to be uh, pretty spicy. So stick around. I'll see you next time.